How are we doing, guys? So another pair here now finished, uh, 1210 Mark Twos, wrapped in the ever so popular 3M black camouflage vinyl wrap. Extremely robust, looks beautiful. It is one of my favorite wraps. I think we've been all established by now. One of the most popular wraps that I offer. There's some really nice goodies on these turntables, I tell you. We've got some brand new Concord, or Autophon Concord digital cart units on there. Brand spanking new, they're a twin pack, including a little mini flight case. So they're included. We've got some lovely blue LEDs on here as well. So blue, 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 blue. Nothing overly bright, as you can all see as well. Nothing's gonna blind you when you're looking over the top. SMD blue on the pop-ups. Nice spread of light. Brand new pitch. Brand new pitch trims, brand new shady units, lovely. Arms both rebuilt, we did a new bearing unit on one of these turntable tone arms. One of these had a really bad bearing on the bottom. That's all now been replaced. So I've got one turntable turned on to show you, the other one obviously isn't connected, but you get the idea. I've seen these a million times before now. Uh, I even include graphics, just for those of you that actually don't know this. If you want to have your turntables wrapped, but you're unsure whether you want to have your 45 adapters wrapped in the same style. I don't have to wrap them for you. You can stick them on yourself. It's obviously 3M vinyl, so they're very easy to apply. What you do with the 45 adapters, so you put them on top of the spindles. This is the easiest way of applying them. Pop them onto the center spindle, peel back the vinyl, make sure that this bit, the actual adapter is nice and clean. Peel the edge back, level it up, pop it down, push it all across, and you're away. So obviously the adapters weren't included with these turntables, so I'm including this for the customer so he can stick these on himself. The on-off caps have both been wrapped. I've even wrapped the surrounds. If I get my lamp on this, I don't know if you can see this from the, you can just about see it, but the actual surround for the strobe has also been wrapped in the camouflage. The reason I've done this is because they were actually really badly marked. So I thought the easiest and obvious thing to do, there you go, is obviously just to wrap the surrounds themselves. And that's what I've done. Keeps everything nice and neat. Everything all matches. Got new switches for the 33 and 45 as well on both of these turntables. Everything works beautifully. Custom RCA cables with ground. Uh, brand new power cables as well. Obviously they've been fully serviced inside and out. <laughs> Platters have been polished. These were horrific. They're looking a lot healthier than they were before. The arm section has been deep cleaned, ripped apart. And like I say, there's been a replacement bearing on one of these as well. The socket section has been polished. Everything is done. Everything. The sockets themselves for the dust covers were in a very bad state. They were covered in corrosion. One of them was missing, well, they're both missing sockets on either turntable. There was a bag with parts to be put back on. Customers undecided what he was going to do with his dust covers. So for the time being, what I've done, what I do with a lot of these, if you can see this here, is actually wrapped the back plates for the sockets in the same camouflage vinyl. It covers over all the corrosion. You flat them down flatten off all the corrosion, clean it up, and simply just pop the, the vinyl over the top and cut it around with your surgical blade, and that's what I've done. So yeah, two very, very nice 1210s, which are gonna be leaving tomorrow. All the goodies all completed. One very, very happy customer. I've already shown him pictures. He's got some nice custom slip mats to go on these as well, which I'm in the middle of printing. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd just show you all the end result of another pair that's leaving me. But I'm extremely happy with this, the outcome. And I'm sure my customer will be when he plugs them in as well. So keep your eyes on the page, everybody. There's a fair, fair few more that are going to be uploaded. We've got some powder-coated units that are going to be uploaded. There's a carbon fibre pair that I'm, if I get time, I'll also do a video on that quickly too that I'm supplying to a customer. There are also some very nice, well-looked-after standard 1210s and 1200s that uh, the customers are not deciding to have them wrapped and one pair I actually decided not to wrap <laughs> so you'll see some videos of these moving forward as well but yeah I thought I'd just show you these guys we've seen them a million times before but as with anything I do this is just showing you the out outcome of another pair that's been completed and uh, keep your eyes on the page any questions please pop them down below I will try and get back to you as soon as I can but just please bear in mind that I am fully booked with bookings I haven't got the time to just stop and do comments 
and reply to your comments. I will do it as quick as I can when I get some time spare, guys. But thanks for watching. Keep your eyes on the page.